Hey guys, I'm Nick from Active Chiropractic and I'm going to show you a few exercises for the anterior deep neck muscles. The reason why we work on our deep anterior neck muscles is because during our daily routines we tend to shrug like so. Even when it's a bit cold we shrug our shoulders. Even at the gym, people tend to, for example, doing bench presses, they shrug their shoulders up and they push out. This is not the right technique. There's an exercise called the trap shrug. A lot of people do it and it's actually very bad for um, our neck muscles because we, it works on mainly the posterior neck muscles, for example, the upper traps. It attaches from our shoulders up to our neck, but we don't work on our deep uh, neck muscles. So you need to train it, train it out to keep a balance and it makes our spine nice and healthy as well. Now, if you are suffering from neck pain, please be aware that neck exercises are not the solution to get rid of the pain. It could be a lot of issues happening in your, in your neck and it's best to see a chiropractor such as myself, a physio or a physician just to check it out and make sure everything's okay and get you the proper treatment because there's other issues that could be happening. So guys, all you need is either a phone book or some sort of weight. You can even use a brick or a weighted plate but a phone book is a good, um, good weight that you can start off with. So guys, the first exercise is the nodding exercise. You will actually lead with your forehead, not with your chin. And it's like an exaggerated nod. You can make it harder for yourself by using a phone book. Uh, it looks a bit silly, but it actually makes it a lot, lot harder. How you're not meant to do it is actually lead with your chin. If you lead with your chin, you're essentially just working on your upper traps anyway and your posterior neck muscles. So the next exercise is called maybes. So you lead with opposite ears, side by side. Try to keep your neck parallel to the floor and this will keep the gravity of your head uh, pushing down on your anterior neck muscles. You can make it heavier for yourself by putting a phone book on your forehead once again. It looks a bit silly, but try it. The next exercise is called no-nos. You turn your head side by side, leading with your nose. And once again, keep your neck parallel to the floor and um, off the table. Now, this works on the sternocleidomastoid muscle. It's also called the SEM. So there you have it, guys. These exercises definitely will give you more strength in the neck and help you, for example, sports like boxing, jiu-jitsu, wrestling, for more neck stability as well. And once again, if you're getting neck pain or anything like that, please consult a physician or professional and get it sorted out. Thanks for watching, guys. Remember to like, share, comment, and uh, I'll keep posting the videos weekly.